Hello group, uh, this is your boy Jay Patrick and just wanted to chime back in. I had to cut it short yesterday because the kitties uh, was on the call and I had to step off and had to take care of them. But I'm back right back at you guys and I just want to touch base with you guys and some of the things I have been seeing across, you know, kind of all industries. Uh, Rather you're starting a company or you're just trying to establish something personally is that personal branding is going to be here to stay there is no way around that and I want to talk to you about how you best can put your 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 your, your best foot forward on the digital space some of you guys have done a great job of it um, I have recently was talking to a current client and they were a big fan of mr. Charles English platform uh, just want to give you a shout out Charles somebody was looking at you and said you were doing great I know we had an opportunity to work together but uh, you know just being able to put yourself in a digital space so I wanted to talk to you guys about creating content um, and I just want to start by, I want you to start thinking about um, who do you want to influence? Who are the people that are in search of something that you feel like you can serve? What are their problem points? What are those products and services that you seek to provide that's going to provide them the solution that they, they are seeking for? And also, what are those benefits uh, from those said services or the feeling that they're going to feel once they have uh, solved their problem and that's kind of the essence of branding It's not about what you say it is it's about what your customers say it's going to be so today I want to talk to you guys about kind of creating that content that best delivers your experience or what the experience that they potentially can receive from you and one of those things is that what you can do is share your story um, and it could be a, a, a couple of ways that you can kind of share a story you can share a story three different ways um, you know I kind of just jotted these notes down and one of the things you can talk about what you learned through an experience that's one thing that you can do uh, talk Talk about an experience that you had and some of the steps you took to get yourself from problem to solution. Another thing is, you know, being that you're a subject matter expert in your space and you're kind of keeping up with other subject matter experts in your space, if you find something good, it's always good to share that tip to your, your audience. Um, that could be another way of creating content. Last but not least, and I think this is one that we don't do enough of and I'm I'm starting to practice what I preach and start giving giving that is give your opinion or your take on some of the things in your industry when you see big news hit um, a great example of that is a, there's a great show on ESPN that's called first take and basically they give their take on things that are happening in sports news so I, I don't think that's um, not a bad idea for any industry in their space to be able to give their take on things. Uh, the next setup, uh, the next piece of content piece I believe that you can work on is talking about yourself. You know, tell them wh who you are, where you come from, how you got into the space that you are into in regards to your uh, your your space of flow as far as your your workspace. What do you decide to do business in? Um, in addition, and show how who you're seeking to serve through those services that you're going to provide. I believe that is a great story. I think Apple done it best um, in regards to doing that. You know, they were seeking to serve creators and they were seeking to create uh, serve creators through their design of tech and the simplicity of their software. And that's the story that they told told throughout their 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 brand makeup. Uh, last but not least, you could tell or uh, create content on your product. Now that is easy for an individual who may have an actual product. They can actually shoot a video, show what it does, shows the problem. I mean, show uh, the, the problem that it solves and shows some of the key features and benefits. But how would you do that from a service? So 
one of the things you're gonna have to look into is either a you know kind of really tell the whole story from the problem to the services that you know the kind of the the processes it took to get to that desired result maybe you kind of create the story based on somebody's case study and be able to capture that rather that's via video or word and that's based on any of these story uh, formats that I'm discussing in regards to creating content and always remember despite what form of content that you're seeking to create that you create some form of call to action um, that way if you're able to a collect contact information B if you want to engage the discussion more further leave some form of question leave some form of action so you can find out if people are even reviewing the information even if they were actually you know going to the website whatever that action is so you can find something so you're able to measure your content creation for success and be able to pivot where necessary and that is my little tidbit for today for you guys are just trying to uh, share some information that you may find useful in your content creation endeavors via social media feel free if, uh, to dis if you want to discuss this further to shoot the comments down below guys y'all take care peace